it's really slippery. This is water. Oh, yeah, this one. This, this one. This one. This one. Okay. Like water. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Do you want this one? Yeah. Okay, so we have our live octopus. I'm so excited, but there's three, and that's so much. And I, my family doesn't want to eat it. Only I do. So hopefully, I can finish all of it. There are a lot of like vendors and stuff like looking at me. So I'm not gonna record too much, but it's really cool. We're on our way to the restaurant now to eat the fish and stuff that we bought. So I'm excited because live octopus. Ah! going down this tiny little okay it's raining this like sketchy little oh no we're here just kidding all right we're in here and they actually like reserved the whole restaurant for us i don't know if they were joking or not but like it's all empty <gasps> okay so the first thing is abalone wait no, what's this, this one, one? This one. Can, can you help me out with this help a girl out yeah help it's a sister weird. out abalone this is what it yeah. looks like yeah. and then i'm dipping it in the sesame oil and then the spicy stuff. Mm. What do you think? Pretty good. Mm -hmm. Mostly. Not bad. I think they cooked it and it's not raw. That's why it's not as bad as like when Amber tried it. Oh my god. Mm. It's like a long string. Okay, so I have a piece right here. Ready? 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 ready. Like chewing so viciously. It didn't stick to my mouth, so that's good. Ooh, it's good. I like it. Alright guys, so I have come to you can see it. The Pledis building! Yay! Where 17 is, but I think they just left. And it's covered in glass. <laughs> Alright guys, so via Isabella's recommendations, I have come to the kind of coffee, coffee and tea, the book cafe. I have about 10-15 minutes here and I have to finish all of this. It's so late. It's like in the middle of a grande at a venti at Starbucks. And it's a green tea frap. It's so good. It's so matcha -y. I'm like not sweet at all, which is so good. But then after that, I have to go back to Gamambu office. And then I can go to One Million Dance Class. Ah! As you guys saw, it was a very rainy day today. Literally like, it's raining so hard. I can't go anywhere without my trusty umbrella. Cranes really like like the J umbrellas, which is kind of inconvenient if you have like a bag, but I don't know. It's really sturdy and like really cheap, so. so I don't know if I mentioned this earlier, but I don't think 17 were in the building because one, there were no fans outside. Two, it's rainy. It's like really rainy, so I don't know if fans would be outside. But also, guys, I saw Joshua and Burton's new hair colors. Oh my gosh, guys, it's, I, I don't know how I feel about it. I love the pink on Joshua, but I don't know how I feel about the orange on Vernon. But they were like getting out of the car, and it was like recent, so I think that they were in the building. I don't know. Okay, so we are back in the Myeongdong shopping street, and we got our first street food. It is the famous egg bread. There's like sunflower seeds and almonds. Oh my god, it's so hot. It's so hot and I'm like sweating and my hands are burning. Ah! Okay, okay, okay. This side's smaller. Mm. Look at how big the egg yolk is. Is that good Hitama? Oh my god. <laughs> So my parents just stopped for scallops and with cheese. Whoa, green cheese is always so stringy. All I taste is cheese and chewy. <laughs> Chris was the teacher for the beginners class and she spoke English and Korean so it was easy to like ask questions and stuff but then I just met up with my family back in Myeongdong. It's so pretty at night guys. Look at all the lights and everything behind me. Ah! 
this is like such a fun place to go to. Um, like there are little makeup shops all down the street as you guys saw, and some clothing shops. But the thing is, is that if you walk like, I don't know, like a hundred more feet down the street or take another like detour down to another street, there is the same exact shop. So we literally passed, well, we've literally passed like three Alex, nature republics, three club <laughs> Cleos, like everything. There's a Forever 21 and H&M, which is like insane. And there's also like street food lining the shop. So you can shop for makeup or you can eat street food, which is such a fun place to go to. Even though like Myeongdong area is very touristy and it's predominantly like Chinese tourists to the point where if you go into a store, Sometimes they'll like I'm Asian like obviously so when we go in they think that I'm like a Chinese tourist or something And they'll just start talking to me explaining to me like everything about the makeup in Chinese Which is kind of funny despite it being a really popular place like it is popular for a reason So you should definitely come here if you're ever in Seoul Oh where it is. Okay, so it's the Ujiro Iga station. You can get out at exit 7 or 8. Um, 7 or 8 will be Lots of Young Plaza, which is a really cool place too. It has a nice food court. Um, but then if you just walk like down and across the street, then it's this huge street of shopping stuff. Um, it's a little easy to miss. Like I didn't know where it was at first. But if you just look around, then you'll definitely find it. And then there's one main street. And then like I said earlier, there are a bunch of detour streets and you can just find all this like really cool stuff. Okay, so we got the dragon's beard candy. I got the one with chocolate on the inside. I think I just saw how we made it. This is it. It turns really chewy because it used to be honey. It's really good. It's kind of hard to eat. It looks really weird. I know a lot of people would be turned off by it because it looks like hair. And you would think that like, sorry, it's hard to get down. You would think that like, um, it would be like eating a lot of hair in your mouth and it kind of like turns you off. But it like just solidifies and it turns into like a chewy honey thing, which is really yummy. Okay, so I finally found a Too Cool for School and I got the Art Class by Rodin Bronzer contour kit that everyone's been talking about. So I'm really happy. We also went to A-Land and I got these like, wait, ooh, a Line Friend store. Hang on. starting to clean up. So this seems to be a really popular street food. The line is so long, guys. Look at all those people waiting. 
just for this. What is it though? It's like a shredded cabbage crepe thing with an egg on it. And the egg is so big and like egg looking, like cartoony looking. It looks like Gouda Thomas laying on it. Really, guys, it looks really like.